Today we got a unboxing of this Crossbone Gundam. And uh, before we get into this unboxing, I'm gonna go ahead and lay you in on a, an embarrassing secret. I ordered this from Big Bad Toy Store and I was so stoked to get this thing because of the little cape the dude has. Like, I just thought it looked, it just the whole aesthetic of it looked really sick and I thought it was gonna look sick with my Gundam collection. And I, was, I really thought I was gonna build this thing. And I even went out and splurged and got the official Gundam snippers and everything. I was like, yeah, I'm gonna do this thing right. This thing's gonna be sick. And uh, I was even like just going through all, I was just going through all these different scenarios on like what I was gonna do, how I was gonna like do, how I was going to like, maybe like do some like modded paint on it and like all this little stuff. And then uh, finally picked it up and realized that the back has this fucking dude on it. So we're literally not going to be doing any kind of build. I I was really thinking I was gonna go into this thing and build it, but it looks like it's just gonna be a quick unboxing. I mean, at the very least, this thing looks sick. I'll give it that. Gun to build speed run. Yep. Helps if you look at the instructions. This thing is wacky, holy shit. Okay, so we have to put this whole rip the head off. This shit on top. Like that, okay. There we go. Literally just wanted this dude to wear his cape. It's all the benefits of building a Gundam because you get all the, you know, swap all the stuff out, choose, really customize your dude, but none of, none of the, uh, the heartache of having to drool through all that shit. Whoop, there it goes. There goes the hand. Wrong hand.
do that right there. Use old boy's blade. do with like the feet like there's little notches right there to put the knives in and stuff but like what's the point when um there's no stand for this dude how are you supposed to do those crazy those crazy things when like how is he supposed to stand up at the at the end of it probably just stick with something simple like that i'm not gonna do anything too crazy with this dude That's the final product of this dude. I mean, I'm using this to like kind of prop him up because you can't have him in a dynamic pose without him falling over because he didn't come with a stand.